see some ruins up ahead. Wait here. I'll go take a look. Oh, Victor. You still do a lot of traveling these days? Yeah, I try. I tend to pick jobs that get me away from the computer. Yeah, I was telling Nathan it's shocking how much of the business has moved to the Internet. I mean, I bet you have all sorts of options to get in the hot car over. Yeah, sure, but I prefer talking to clients face to face. Get a good read on them. Hard to do that in a chat room talking to some guy named Antiquity Master 37. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. Hmm. Not much to see here. Well? Ah, nothing worthwhile. Come on, let's keep going. Hey, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is going to erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Trust me, that's the first thing I looked up when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where to rent the cheapest four by. Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time, kid. Would you look at that? A secret cave behind a waterfall. Gentlemen, we are on a pirate adventure. What are you, seven? So, Victor, how is it that you know King's Bay so well, huh? Well, first time out here was for a swap. Of course, you went bad and I got a wreck. <laughs> to come visit him. Oh, my mistake. It wasn't like that for once. We just saw the world in a simple way. Besides, she moved. It was there a few years since we've seen each other. Maybe time for a visit. Maybe. First. It's a note. All right, let's get moving. A little warning next time. That's the first time in years I've had two showers in one day. That bridge there is what you would call rickety. Uh, this looks promising. Come on, come on, baby. Let's go, 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 go. Made it. Okay, kid. Just don't drop us. Hey, just keep it slow. Keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going on. Ah! We're good. Careful, careful. Sorry, guys. Onward and upward. We're getting nowhere fast. You need traction here. Nathan the rocks. I got it. 
Okay, I think I'm getting the hang of this. No, turn into it. There we go. Ha <laughs> ha! Jesus. Oh, my spine. Look, tire tracks. Someone came up this way. Look up there on the hill. Got a tower or something. Now we're talking. Hey, Victor, what were you arguing with the rental guy? Oh, your brother insisted on getting a 4x4 with a winch. So you sprung for the winch, but you couldn't spring for the suspension. I got it. Hey, it's important. Going off road, it might rain, might be muddy. How about we go through this whole goddamn thing and never use that winch? <laughs> no, sorry. Experiencing a little turbulence. Take this slow, kid. Yeah. So, Nathan, you're thinking Avery, Two, and some other big shot pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because... why exactly? Who knows? Maybe for protection? The British authorities were closing in on them. Sure. Maybe, uh, he helped them disappear. I mean, the guy clearly had a knack for hiding things. <clears throat> Let's go check out that tower. I'll come with. It's in pretty good shape or something several hundred years old. Yeah. Definitely ruins from Avery's era. Sam, look. That's Christopher Condon's sigil. He's uh, captain of the Fiery Dragon, operated out of Madagascar around Avery's time. So maybe Avery recruits pirate captains to what be his lookouts? That don't make any sense. No, it doesn't. <laughs> stripped away. Something was wrapped around this tree. Did you know our car came with a winch? No, oh, really? I didn't know that. What you gonna do with it? Not sure yet. than it looks. Uh, 
All right, ready? Give it a shot. Here we go. Steady. Steady. <laughs> See, Sully? Winch. Totally worth it. We cleared a hill. It hasn't exactly paid for itself. Well, not yet. Small victory. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. Feast your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Spectacular. Just imagine. You've come here. A well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. Ha, <laughs> poor oppressed pirates. All they wanted to do was to murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, you could do a lot worse than here. It's taken forever to get to this volcano. Patience, Victor, patience. Do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa. Yeah. And they figured all that out with paper, charts, and by looking at the stars. Hey, you're describing sailing to a former squid. The point is, we got it pretty easy. Yeah. No. Still taking a long time. Oh, shit! Stop! Stop! What do we got? Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. But the wrong one, right? That's the good news. Yeah, that means it's bad news. The only route to the volcano is straight through them. Oh, shit. We do have the drop on them. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead.
Okay. I think that's it. God damn it. Rafe and Nadine must have dozens of guys out here. I mean, they, they could just stumble onto the treasure through blind luck. Look, another sigil. Huh. Adam Baldridge. He ran King's Bay for a while. He was a traitor, slaver, general scoundrel. Look at you. Yeah. Prison. A lot of books. Jesus, these pirates really need to work on their infrastructure. Now, how do we get out of here? The rest of that bridge looks like it could come down any minute. Again with the winch, Sully. Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch. I was against getting ripped off. Sully, just how well do you know Nadine? Why? I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> you know, right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than rape? No, that's not how she operates. She's more of a money-up-front kind of mercenary. Look, Shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. He's thinking the same damn thing. But they found the treasure already. Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah, well, you're right. <laughs> I meant to do that. Hey, Sam, if you don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was this one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. You to check out books from the library for me. What would you read? <laughs> History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates. Just in case, you know. Sure. But you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. That's pretty much it. Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked them to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. Check it out, boys. What is it? You can probably see all of King's Bay from up here. Yeah. Hey, look. There's the city. And there's the river valley. <clears throat> hey, guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline, Mercs? I can't tell. So, how are you doing? Yeah, still in one piece. I appreciate you coming along for the ride. And especially for negotiating with that rental guy. <laughs> no problem. Hell, I'd be lying if I said I wasn't enjoying myself. <laughs> Me too. I'll let you look at this. Quite the view. I just keep waiting to wake up and find myself in solitary or something. <laughs> it's all some kind of dream. Sam. No, no, no guilt trip. I'm just... Let's go find this thing. 
You bet. Here we got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. Hey, what do you make of the drawbridge, Nathan? A little out of place. But you don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to protect something. Such as pirate treasure? <clears throat> Maybe. Sounds good. Hey, be careful, kid. All right, I'll see if there's something up here. Hey, guys! There's a massive tower just past the drawbridge. Biggest one yet. Bingo. Sam! You got this? Mm-hmm. I seen a few. I'll bring the car closer. Are you two just relax? I got this. I mean, there's only one crank, you know? <laughs> Keep up the good work, kid. Come out! Promise to make it quick for you! 